the reciprocal of the product of two consecutive integers is 1 and 1 three, uh, 132nd. Find the integers. Yeah, so we got the reciprocal. Um, but it's the reciprocal of the product. So what operation are we talking about here? Multiplication, right? So if I said x, x is the lower number. Lower number. Now, since it's consecutive, lower number. The next number would be the lower number, but plus 1. Okay. Um, and it did say integers, so we're looking at the whole values, whether they're negative or positive. So in other words, if I take the reciprocal, the product, by the way, would be the lower number times the next number, which would be x plus 1. The reciprocal of that, well, that would be um, over 1. So the reciprocal of that would be 1 over x times x plus 1. Okay. And it told us that the answer to that is, so that's equals 1 over 132. And here's why you can do that is because if we were to cross multiply, then we get 132 times 1, which is 132, and 1 times x times x plus 1, which is just x times x plus 1. From here, we can distribute the x, which gives us uh, x squared plus x. This equals 132. This looks like a polynomial that we'll be factoring, right? quadratic so minus 132 from both sides so that it equals 0 and we get 0 equals x squared <clears throat> plus x minus 132 so let's look to split one thir negative 132 we need two numbers which would add up two factors which would add up to 1 and right now I'm looking at um, negative 11 and 12 on that because if I add those together I would get the 1 so it looks like 0 equals x minus 11 and x plus 12 meaning that uh, we would solve each of these individually so x minus 11 should equal 0 because if that's equals 0 it still gives us a true statement so x is 11 but also that uh, would have x minus, uh, x equals negative 12. Sorry, let me show the work on that. x plus 12 equals 0. So subtract 12 from both sides. x equals negative 12. So we have two answers for what would be x, which we described as the lower number. So for 11, we would have 11 and 12. If I multiply these two together, I do get... Well, the reciprocal of that would be 132, uh, 1 over 132. So these two work. But if uh, you put 11 and 12, it That was my second answer on that, right? So on the other hand, we need to look at that negative 12, which is the lower number. The next number consecutively would be negative 11. If I multiply these two together, I also get 132. So this one has two answers.